slide. I need my money, nigga, slide. Four, bitch, slide. Keep you know, best condition, most professional, unselfish, toughest, nastiest, dislike team in the NBA. We didn't care about it. That was our identity, and that's who we were. Let's go. We got Mitchell Robinson back. Mitchell Robinson back. No place better than in New York to have a defensive center, one of the top defensive centers that we built from the ground up. Let's go, baby. I know I'm a little bit late on this video, but it's been a crazy, crazy offseason. Teams are making moves and everything. But one thing we got to do is just stick to the plan. It's so funny. Don't let nobody out there try to embarrass you for taking the correct steps. That's like somebody embarrassing you because you got a budget or that you keep track of your finances and you out there, you're not out there sense senselessly spinning. So it's, it's good. It's good. We checking them off. I'm about to do a quick video also on Jalen Brunson. Our first point. Come on, man. Come on, man. Don't let nobody convince you and act, act like we ain't making the right steps. You know what I mean? Act, don't let them convince you. We doing it the way we supposed to be doing it. And I only want to talk about that coward across the bridge. I'm going to make another video for that. But meanwhile, this is about money making Mitch. This cat really put forth that effort, pushed through injuries this season, really pulled off a great season. Uh, we watched them develop. We've helped them develop. We watched them grow. You know, we watched them figure out the best, you know, uh, frame and, and, and size to have to play a full, you know, season, as full of a season as he is. You know, great contract. Some people will talk about the amount. Fuck all that. You're supposed to pay. You're supposed to pay and take care of your people on your squad, man. How many teams? I guarantee you there was teams lined up to take Mitch. So let's not sit there. We always underrate. You know, people say we always overvalue our players. Don't don't buy into that bullshit either, man. Yo, we 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 underrate them. We expect more from them, and we're trying to get a hometown discount. Nah, man, it's a premium on young centers that you have, that you build from the ground up, who could be the anchor of your defense. And don't get it twisted. No matter what the league is offensive three-pointers at the end of the day you got to stop somebody so it's good that we have about three players now who we have in the center who could be able to stop somebody so i don't care what anybody says man don't don't let nobody try to convince you otherwise these guys don't know what they're talking about or what they'll try to do is try to convince you that what you have ain't about it that what you have ain't good enough so that they can dim your shine but i tell you this much the people across the bridge know what's good what's up they, they know what's up, man. I was just watching the locks versus dip set. And that's funny because we the locks, orange and blue. Them niggas over there is dip set. Classics, but you know who run the city. And right now we up. And I'm telling you, they done messed up and let us get a, a, a beyond competent point guard. Come on, man. They, it's separate video. But congratulations to Money Making Mitch, Blockless Monster, bro. We building it step by step, brick by brick. Got that man his bag. But I tell you this much, man, Mitch, we know you watch social media. We know you pay attention to the channels as well. So we, 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 you know, we, you know we riding with you, but we need you to take it a, a step up. We need you to take a step up. You've been bullying cats with a smile. And that makes people aware of who you are. But start, I mean, once you start taking it serious, and you start wanting to hit your goals, defensive player of the year, leading the league in blocks, you know, leading the league in offensive rebounding, them knowing that once they face up with the New York Knicks, man, they got a problem in the middle, all game, that's when you start to change the game. That's when you start to help change the personality of our squad, who we known as. Right now, you're too jokey. Everybody talks about your maturity. You know, we love that. You can have that on the side. But the moment you step on that court, man, and we know you, you do it, but nah, man, don't let those cats pound you up, dap you up after the game, give them the fist bump and leave. But before the game and during the game, listen, you, you we need an enforcer. Who's our enforcer? It has to be the, you, you play, your results play like an enforcer, but your personality got to match it. You know, we've seen you, you know, from the mud, pull, you know, was able to take a chance on you late second round, you know, but now, now you got the bag. You part of the fabric. You New York now. You know, you, you've been playing like you've been New York all the time. But um, but we rock it with you, man. So let these cats tell it. You know, we mediocre. Let, let them believe that. We always want to be underestimated and come from behind and, and, and start taking cats out silently. You know, so 
Uh, we up. Congratulations. We got money making Mitch in the center. We've solidified that defensive presence in the paint. Still got Jericho Sims, who got somebody to battle in, a, in, in practice now so he can get better. And we got a new addition at center as well. So we're going to talk about that also. But I apologize for being late on this video. I got the others coming soon. I'm going to talk a little bit about our new point guard, as well as what moves we see being made next. Everybody's talking about we can see ourselves moving Julius by the trade deadline in February. I don't think so. I think he's going to have a nice, fresh start in the summertime. You know what I mean? Once again, this is not talking about Julius's game. Julius is a bad boy. But at the same time, he wants a fresh start. We need a fresh start. So let's go. Man, it's, the, the league is on fire right now. NBA, I don't care what anybody says. The NBA offseason right now, it's one of the best in sports. And I'm loving every moment of it. Let's go, Knicks. Care what you say. How much talent, Hall of Fame talent you got on your squad. When you build it brick by brick and you build the culture right and you don't steal it or trade it out, Man, you ha you have good things, man. So, let's go. Let's go. No, no, let's listen, speak. listen, 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 you. listen, 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 listen. I don't want peace. I want problems always. Yeah.